It's been said that a dog is a man's best friend, but if you're a stock dog, chances are you're not only a rancher's best friend, you're also his or hers best employee. Juan Reyes is a rancher from Wheatland, Wyoming, and he's also one of this nation's top stock dog handlers. This year, he was invited to the Niles Stock Show in Billings, Montana, to talk about why his stock dogs are some of his top hands. That's exactly right. They, they do an enormous amount of work for us, Russell. Uh, these dogs uh, do all aspects of livestock, cow-calf, yearlings. They work uh, big country and they, uh, they work the confinement areas and, and they do it in such a way that the livestock stay calm after, uh, after you get them introduced, after you get the stock introduced to them as, uh, it's a very stress-free uh, environment. During his stock dog demonstration at the Nile Stock Show, Juan also passed along some of his tips for people thinking about getting a stock dog or two. It's going to take good breeding. It's going to take someone that knows about dogs. Uh, and there's, enorm there's a lot of ways. There's videos, there's books. Uh, people can learn about this. Uh, you know, the, mainly the books and the videos are uh, on sheep, uh, but it, it's very similar. It's the same concept. Uh, I have as much admiration for a dog, and I've seen it, that pushes a lamb into a confinement area without biting it, as I do a dog like you just saw a few minutes ago with his mouth open and uh, just ready to attack if he needs to, but don't. So, so I think understanding mm -hmm. is a big part of uh, what we need, what I would like ranchers and farmers to, to realize. And Juan says stock dogs are the perfect fit for today's low stress livestock handling concept. Uh, absolutely, uh, and that's why I'm doing this. Uh, that's why I went to NCBA in San Antonio mm -hmm. to, uh, to have a crowd of ranchers there and, uh, and show them what we could do with these dogs. Uh, you know, low stress is going to be the key for this industry. And, and, and really, you go back in years, the good stockmen were low stress. You know, so, so I, think, I don't think it's anything new. It's just that we're using a dog to do it. From milk bones to tea bones, just like ranchers, stock dogs love their cattle too. Reporting from the Nile Stock Show in Billings, Montana, I'm Russell Nimitz, Northern Egg Network.